Arden. Schmidt Laboratories makes a little more than one out of every three condoms sold in the U.S. And every condom that Schmidt makes comes through this plant in Anderson for testing, packaging, and shipping. I'm a latex tester. A latex tester, and that's another way of saying what? That I test condoms for a living. These machines are so sensitive that sometimes it's hard to figure out why the machines even rejected a condom. Here's a reject right here. Well, check it. I don't know, can you see anything wrong with this? You may not have ever known that people make a living testing condoms, but they do. And the job is keeping them very busy. I think the AIDS epidemic's picked up business a lot. And it's got you working six days a week. Yeah. The market has, I think, benefited from the not only advertising, but certainly the uh, exposure that we've been given as a result of uh, AIDS. It's hard to prove that AIDS is the reason, but as people in the business will tell you, more and more people are using more and more condoms. Schmidt's condom sales were up 10% last year. With AIDS, you know, on the rampage like it is, they've got to do something to protect themselves. If you're sexually active, a condom is one of the only sources of protection against AIDS that you can find. And Schmidt is one of only two companies in the U.S. that can sell you that protection. Schmidt, very fortunately, is uh, growing at a rate uh, in the condom area uh, well in, in excess of the, uh, the market growth rate. In fact, things are going so well that Schmidt's Anderson plant will soon be retooling and adding a production line. As AIDS goes, so does the condom. Dave Kenny, First News, Anderson.